about experiential therapy. Trauma is something that also stays in our body. So being out here with animals that are really clear about being in their bodies can be a really healing experience. So what we're gonna have you do first is introduce yourselves to the horse. Just go, go, go meet them. See which one you're drawn to because you're gonna work with one horse today. This exercise is all about building a safe space for Jacob and his new friend, and also he's asked to label three things, if not more, that he needs to bring with him into the safe place. He labeled the horse, he labeled his family, or his dad in particular, and he labeled his dog. Everything that he labeled is significant. And now we gave him an activity that was a bit of a challenge for him to figure out how to use the halter around the horse. It's something that he's never done before. Uh -huh. He's pretty tuned in to you, wouldn't you say? Yeah. I'm trying to figure this out, though, but that wouldn't go over. That would go right there. Oh my gosh, this is difficult. <laughs> it took him about 20 minutes. He was able to manage it, and that was a bit of an emotional breakthrough when he realized that he could do it on his own. I think I did it. What's this like for you right now? Um, it's pretty cool. Oh. Be able to bond with them and connect. It's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. It was obvious that he was becoming emotional and tearful. Jacob had a breakthrough today. He opened up more about the incident. I am feeling tremendously encouraged.